first impression, as you drive up, it looks really, really nice. Driveway and the lobby area looks like five-star resort. This is my room, garden view. Uh, we have like a little section over here. I wonder if it's actually a pool. Yeah, it is. So if you come in with um, kids, they can sleep here. This is the king size bed. Um, the balcony, lanai. Um, watch your steps, there's like two steps over here so you can fall. Ooh. Ooh, watch out. We have the garden room, the garden view. It's very quiet here. Like you really do feel like you're in the garden. You hear the birds chirping and you know, just kind of like nature. Um, I believe they do luau over here. I guess we'll find out. But it kind of makes sense. There's like a stage. Uh, we have like a little peekaboo view and Basketball court. I think they have tennis courts and uh, pick a ball court as well. They just remodeled all the rooms, so everything is brand new here. Here, water bowl, bottles, coffee maker. That's just ice bucket on here. Some storage area. Here we have safe ironing board. So, slippers. And here's the bathroom. Welcome to Hawaii. Everything looks nice and clean. We got some goodies here. Beautifully wrapped in banana leaves. It's very popular over here for things to be wrapped like that. I just love it. I personally absolutely love it. Look. Yum! The property looks really pretty. I'm here in September and it's not very busy really good time to visit lots of areas to explore these are the lights that they shine at night to attract manta rays this area hasn't been renovated yet to be honest i'm getting a little lost the property is pretty big um yeah I think we have to kind of get used to and find our way around this whole place. There's no actual beach over here, you access the water from the rocks. There's two pools over here. This is the adult only pool. These chairs are so cute. They are at the towel stand which is located at the family pool. <laughs> family pool is very spacious with lots of sitting areas. 
it has a ginormous slide. I took a full advantage of this slide. It was so much fun. I'm not exactly a full person, but this slide has, yeah, has something on me. <laughs> I already went on it like eight times, I think. And there's not really many kids here today because it's like a school day. So totally taking a full advantage of that. Cute little pool bar. When you're in Hawaii, you have to eat pocket. We're not very original. When you're in Hawaii, you just have to go with the pocket. That's what you need to do. And French fries. That I never say no to. People do yoga in the water. Laundry room available for your convenience. Self parking is a few steps away, but there is valet parking if you don't want to walk. Voyager Club Lounge comes always handy when you want to grab something to eat. They're still working on Voyager Club. It's a temporary club. They're working on the real one and it's supposed to be like really, really cool when it's done. This hotel is located on the west side, so you will never miss a sunset. And sunsets here are really, really beautiful. After the sunset, they turn on the lights and mantas start coming to the shore. Definitely the best spot in Hawaii to see manta rays. Manta washing is a really great experience you will never forget. going to swim with manta rays. It's a really short walk from the hotel, so we could not pass this opportunity. Because most of the times you just stay in Kona and you know, it's like a way longer trip. They take you on a boat. They actually bring you right over here, right in front of our hotel. So since we're staying here at the Outrigger, they're right in front of the Outrigger. We just have to do it. If you want to learn more about swimming with manta rays, you can check out my other vlog. Pool is open until 10 p.m. But if you come later, no one says anything as long as you behave yourself and stay quiet. At night, you see so many stars over here, it's crazy. So I can only imagine how spectacular it is to go stargazing and Mauna Kea. It's so quiet over here, so peaceful, like you hear only like some kind of like animals when you wake up in the morning, like you only hear the birds tripping. Now they are moaning the grass, so you hear a little bit of that. Right now we're just gonna go to the Voyager Club, grab some breakfast.
You have two options for breakfast here. You can go to Voyager Club or you can go to Pico. I just spotted this hammock and I had to try it. The hotel decor is mostly about manta rays. This is breakfast buffet at Voyager Club. You're definitely not going to be hungry. And this is breakfast at Pico. You can order something a la carte or you can have breakfast buffet, which we did. You can book all your activities by the adult pool. So many resorts on the Big Island. Why would you want to choose the Outrigger Resort? They have something that no one else has. They have manta rays. They have awesome viewing deck that you don't even have to go on a boat to, you know, swim with them. You can see plenty of them from the viewing deck. They come so close to the shore. If you have ocean view room, you can even see them from your lanai, from your balcony. That's the highest point of the hotel. The hotel is still under renovation. It used to be, it used to be Sheraton and Outrigger bought it just a few years ago and they are still renovating. It's like 60 million renovation project. So this whole way you can definitely tell it's been renovated. As of right now, they only have two restaurants, Holua and Pico on the other side of the pool. That's the adult pool. I've heard that like upscale restaurant is coming. Both of these restaurants are more like casual. So the Holua is more kind of like beach bar. I mean, pool bar, I should say. And Pico is like wine bar uh, slash like breakfast um, buffet, I would say. So it's, they're both casual. Elevators are a little heated. So you walk by and you don't really see them. Which I guess is fine because if makes you to use the stairs. There is not really any beach over here. There's this like little opening on the rocks where you can enter the water somehow, like right over there. People jump off rocks over here. Um, they do um, have like kayaks, paddle boards and all of that and they, they put them like on the water for you. The lights that they turn on for the manta rays to come to the shore, they're not on the whole night. I think they turn, turn them off somewhere like around midnight. There's a few hammocks over here, which is kind of cool. The lobby is really beautiful. These are breadfruits. They're not ripe yet. This hotel is great if you want to go to like two-step beach and the national park that is like right next to it's literally like 20 minutes drive from here and that's pretty cool because those two places are like literally my favorite places on the island